<laughs> since you want to play, this is giving arcade. 1999, we're coming for you. What's up guys, my name is Curly, and as you know, I love fashion. So today we are hanging out here at this amazing vintage store to thrift a 90s look, but I need a little bit of help. So I decided to call the homegirl over in Bel Air, Miss Coco Jones, the singer, songwriter, actress, goddess, Hillary Banks 2.0. Wow! Hello. What are you? Oh, you look so beautiful. Thank this is you. amazing. Thank you. Wait, who is this by? This is Ricky Brazil. Can I give a little spin? You know, I mean, I can if that's what we're doing here. Well, today I'm gonna actually need a little bit of your help. I want to okay. do like a '90s inspired Fresh Prince look. Ooh. But I am super like almost allergic to color. I only wear earth tones, and I don't want to live this life forever. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, let's do it. Okay. Well, then it's a color day. I haven't styled in a while. Either way, it's gonna give in West Philadelphia, born and raised. Alrighty, babes, let's go do this. Let's do some right. shopping. Let's get you cute. All right, let's do it. After you. Thank you, darling. How would you describe your style in three words? Classy, uh -huh. sexy, mm -hmm. lively. As I'm coming of age, uh -huh. I'm getting into my sexy Leading bag. Into it. Yeah. And like Same trying days. also to wake the girls up, but not like alarm. What does this know? mean, wake the girls up? Like, I'm grown, oh, okay. but not like, I'm grown now. It's like, <laughs> I'm grown, you know? I thought for a second we were talking about our boobs. No, not them girls. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm seeing a lot of overalls over here. I feel yes. like that's super 90s. Okay, these are these are giving 90s. Are they? I mean, they're baby blue, you <laughs> yeah. know? Would you date a guy who was in these overalls? I would need to see the swag because I don't know if I want hip to the hop, the yeah. hip to the hippie. So, you know who looks really good in overalls? Tupac. Came to end. All 5'2 of him. He's not 5'2. Hey Siri, how tall was Tupac? Tupac Shakur was five feet nine inches tall. Exactly. Oh. I knew his energy was that's up sexy. there. Yeah, let's get you some color. I like her. That's good. You know, that's very pop of color. I mean, it's giving me a little bit of a minion, which I'm not surprised because I know Capricorns uh, like to sabotage Virgos <laughs> all the time. Oh, is it giving saboteur? <laughs> Since you want to play, this is this is giving arcade. Since you want to play games. I, I love this for you. You know, they did daring stuff in the 90s. <laughs> it was about standing out. This is giving red alert. Hilary Banks is kind of known for being super iconic in fashion, always. Mm -hmm. And I feel like you're kind of bringing it again as well and kind of redoing it in your own way. Mm -hmm. How much input are you having in Hilary's look now? I feel like I do have a lot of input. Fernando Rodriguez was the stylist. I remember I was the first one to get styled and when yeah. I walked in there, I was like, gas. Have you taken anything? No, they'd be watching me like a hawk. Oh, did you try to embody Hilary Banks when you auditioned for her? I mean, yeah, I think I did it kind of wrong though because I was basing my audition off of OG Hillary. Yes. And in Bel Air, she's much more like grounded. She's more goal oriented. Uh -huh. So I was kind of playing it more like. And Morgan Cooper, our director, he was like, no. So then what happened? He was like, be what you are, like be the star that you are. And I was like, oh, well, I could do that for free. Yes. But I would do it for a check as well. I've told you this already before, often on camera, that your personality is popping. This is how she actually is, like. <laughs> yeah, thank you. This is real. It's giving me Versace on the floor. Yes. Wait, oh Curly. Oh uh, my God. This could be cute. We definitely have to try on. We have to try on. We've got a couple looks now. What are some like pieces that you have to have in your wardrobe? I have to have a good pair of jeans, mm -hmm. a good black heel. And I do a lot of crop tops. I feel like yes. that's an easy well, moment for me. You have to show me. that off. You have to show your finger off. And thank you. <laughs> yeah. Do you have a piece that you can't live without? I would say I just actually got these leather pants because you know leather pants are the moment right now. Yes. I just got these Hemulot Lang. Uh -huh. I don't know how to pronounce. Oh, like Helmet Lang? Yes! Uh -huh, yeah, the yeah. quality is wash. Yes. I, I hope so, but it's a Helmet Lang. Like, yeah, I was like, babes. Is it expensive? Sidebar, you also can sing. And I don't mean like yeah, you can hold bit. like a note. I mean like you can sing. I try, I try. How many times do people make you like sing all the time? I'm not gonna make you do it because I feel like sometimes people always like sing. Actually, what's funny is my mom used to do this thing when we were in meetings and she would rub her earring and that means you need to sing. Shut up. Yeah, so like all the time. So you have a new song called Caliber. Yeah, yeah. I was wondering if you meant like high caliber or like a gun. It's not giving guns blazing, all right? I was kind of hoping it was It's giving bit of a high gun. caliber. This guy's trying to talk to me and I'm like, okay, that's cute and everything, but like you are gonna have to level up because I'm a boss. Yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> what now do you think about this sailor. style? <laughs> 
So you tweeted in 2021, September 16, this girl shouted, Coco, Coco Jones, <laughs> while I was on a date, and I told this man I work at BuzzFeed. <laughs> Wait, that's hilarious because I'm actually here. I know. Hey guys, coworkers, hey. Oh my God, that is so funny. Okay, so backstory. I don't like to tell people that I sing if I feel like they don't already know it because one time I told this guy and he was like, oh, you gonna sing? And ever since then I'm like, Bleh. I make up things. I say I work at my parents' construction company. I say I just moved here looking for a job. I uh. say model. And then when they find out, they're like, wait, you, you really sing though. I'm like, let's see if you switch up. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I, I did tell him I worked at BuzzFeed. What made you pick BuzzFeed that Quinta. day? Quinta! Oh, I Quinta! I love her. I was like, yeah, BuzzFeed, I mean, it's so fun. Like, I get to be creative, you know, come up with a lot of ideas. And then this girl, she was like, Coco? Coco Jones? <laughs> That's always how they do the second one? Yeah, Coco Jones? Like, you got me. Yeah, I'm into it. Culture. Into it. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're in the 90s. What about wildest dreams for your music? Where do you like hope it takes you? I mean, I feel like I'm in a wild ass dream. If I could take it more, I want to do like world tours, international. So what looks do you think that you would go for on stage? I really love like a bodysuit type of, like a jumpsuit type yeah. of vibe. I like glitter and sparkle too. It just reminds me of when I was younger and I literally looked like a actual rhinestone. I try to incorporate black designers. I love me some Laquan Smith. Jessica Rich, I wear a lot of her shoes. Oh, yeah. dope, amazing. I feel like you would like Patrick Kelly. You should totally check Patrick Kelly out. Ooh. He was the first black American to go high fashion Ooh. in like the 80s. Oh, hi. Hi. I'm putting on some of your um, choices. Yay. Questionable. Oh. <laughs> You're the creator of the You Would Do It Too for a Check. I could do that for free. Yes. But I would do it for a check as well. Yeah, I did say that. So I'm going to ask you, what would you actually do for a check? Okay, not just anything. Oh, I would do anything for a check. Anything? Would you tell your ex-boyfriend's new girlfriend that she's hotter than you for a check. Name your price. For me to say to my ex, his girl? Yeah. You're hotter than me? Yes. I'm gonna need at least 50 bands. 50? Yes. I would do it for a good $50. <laughs> Woo! Um, this is giving, don't have your driver's license yet. Almost, <laughs> almost turning 16. It's also giving bowl cut for some reason. Maybe it's just so much chaos here that I can't, I can't vibe with the rest. Cause I'm not mad here. I'm yes. not mad, but I'm, I I'm feel like super angry here. This is like Ronald McDonald vibes to me. Like Ronald, oh, the zip up made it even worse in some way. Sorry, how do straight chaos. guys flirt? <laughs> how, do, how do straight guys flirt? <laughs> they don't Man. pose like that to start. <laughs> That's giving, teacher helping with homework. This was your choice. I thought it was gonna be something different. I thought wrong. Okay, next question. Since Hillary's a chef, would you eat a meal with like a big nasty hair in it? What? No. Why? Curly, what are you saying? You have your whole extensions in my plate. Seriously, okay, that's a health hazard. Babes, are we ready? Almost ready. Cause I'm ready to judge. Okay, babes, here we go. Oh my gosh. Turn around, babes. Woo, yes. Let me see the back. I love the one shoulder off. Is that swag? This is hot. With the jewelry, it's giving cool ass rapper dude. Yes. Giving LL Cool and J. Well, that pose is giving me disco. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. I think we're on a roll now, so this next one's really gonna give. All right, babes. This is the final look. Impress me. I'm bored already. Babes, a lot of accessories. Let's go. And then, Versace. Ooh, this is giving me the swag that I didn't know I needed. I feel like my dad has this outfit and there's this picture somewhere in the attic gathering dust. Yes. Where he's wearing this with a chain and it's giving swag. Nice. It's giving me tasteful. If you dress like this and you see Coco Jones out in public, go and spit game. Not if I have this fur on. If, if I'm wearing this fur, you're better you off not addressing me. But no, I do love this. This is definitely a Fresh Prince era. Very, very Bel Air view. Beautiful. Should we do a catwalk? Yes. Me lady? Let's do this. Where are we walking to? Because it's like a dead end. <laughs> I guess nowhere.
Yes, I think we've done it. Mission is accomplished, no? Yes, thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, gonna go back to my job at BuzzFeed. Well, enjoy. Thank you. Well, what'd you think? How'd you think we did? She thinks we did great. Even though this isn't necessarily like a curly look, it's definitely on brand with like a 90s fresh prince look. So I'm ready. I'm ready for the party.